हेलो फ्रेंड्स माई सर सोनाली सोम मुखर्जी आपके सामने हाजिर हूँ एक नया टॉपिक के लिए टॉपिक पे बुक करने से पहले थोड़ा सा रिक्वेस्ट करना चाहूँगी मेरे इस चैनल को जैसा कि आपने पहले भी किया है मेरे दूसरे चैनल को बहुत सारा सपोर्ट किया है प्लीज सपोर्ट दिस चैनल लेट मी ग्रो माई चैनल इन अ वेरी न्यू डिरेक्शन दिस चैनल इज नॉट गोइंग टू बी ओनली अ फोकस ऑफ बायोलॉजी जेनेटिक्स जैसा कि मैंने वादा किया था अपने वादे को पूरा करना चाहती हूँ लाइक कीजिए शेयर कीजिए सो दट आई गेट सम एनकरेजमेंट टू वर्क फॉर दिस कॉन्सेप्ट मोर एंड मोर चलिए शुरू करते हैं आज का टॉपिक क्या है लेट्स फर्स्ट अंडरस्टैंड टू दिस टॉपिक आज का टॉपिक एग्जैक्टली एक कहानी से शुरू होती है कहानी इस तरह है कि द स्टोरी दट आई वॉन्ट टू शेयर बिफोर आई शेयर इन ई कॉन्सेप्ट इन ए फिनोमिना दैट चार्ल्स डार्विन ही वॉज अ ब्रिटिश naturalist and his theories we know survival of the fittest struggle for existence in his very controversial book that he published it was origin of species and this uh, concept that i want to bring in front is in the form of a story let's talk about the story the story begins that charles darwin was on his voyage on a ship that was hms vehicle i suppose and he was traveling to the islands of galapagos and he, there were several stops means he wanted to stop and observe the local plants and the animals so the voyage was towards the galapagos island where he observed certain species of birds that we all know as darwin's finches the birds that he observed over there now in galapagos island when he was studying on his voyage to this ship he had several stops means he wanted to stop at various areas in south america southern tip of africa and these are the some of the areas that i have mentioned so in his uh, observation he found there are birds which are non identical they belong to similar species not same similar species but not identical the structure of their beaks the shape of their beak was well suited to their eating habit for example a bird which is having a tough and a very strong beak quite flat is very habituated to eat larger seeds similarly a bird which is very much used to eating insects small insects had a very sharp and a very pointed beak so his observations when he was studying he took some pictures not only about the darwin's finches i'm talking about he took about pictures of the local plants and the animals and then he kept it means he did not realize what was the observation that he had been to it was later on when he handed over these pictures to uh, the bird uh, biologist that we call ornithologist they studied and they observed that these were well suited to their environment but this observation in galapagos island was very much similar that ecuador region when he traveled he found that similar kind of uh, observations but here he found that the birds that he were talking about maybe in ecuador the mainland of ecuador where he stopped he took some pictures or maybe the galapagos island this observation was not matching with the birds that were found elsewhere so this gave us the concept that these birds are well suited to their environment so they have survived so they have reproduced and so their frequency has increased in a particular geographical location whereas the other geographical location these birds were not suited to this gave us the very idea of adaptive radiation which i'm going to explain in my later part of this video so stay with me let me move to the next part so, friends branching descent with modification means there are several species around us bahut sare aise species hai hamare aas paas jo samay ke sath sath badalte hain that is 
species change over a period of time though they share a common ancestry yani ki unke ancestors jo hai wo bahut hi common hote hain par alag alag species hote hain samay ke sath sath wo badalte hain now the question arises जो फिट होते हैं क्या वही सर्वाइव करते हैं येस द कॉन्सेप्ट स्टैंड ऑन दिस बेसिस दैट इज डार्विन थियोरी ऑफ डिसेंट विद मॉडिफिकेशन दैट इज स्पीशीज चेंज ओवर अ पीरियड ऑफ टाइम दे रिक्वायर नंबर वन इज एनवायरमेंट पर्टिकुलर एनवायरमेंट इज रिक्वायर्ड विच हैज टू बी मे बी फेवरेबल मे बी नॉट फेवरेबल दैट इज अ हॉस्टाइल एनवायरमेंट बट दे डू हैव द की कॉन्सेप्ट that is they must be fit to survive so only those characteristics which are heritable that is which can be inherited from one generation to another and then pass to the next generation thereby reproduction in the next generation will bring about the frequency number more so this is the key concept that is modification to the gene in certain period of time with certain modifications it can bring about certain changes and thus more number as the reproduction is promoting more number of species in those uh, organisms so in case of natural selection we need to remember the uh, what are the requirements the requirement number one is an environment number two heritable traits should be there that is those traits or characteristics which can be inherited from one generation to another and those species those or the organisms which are able to pass those and then they can bring about the more number that is reproduction this number will increase only those species only those organisms are fit to survive thus we say that uh, survival of the fittest next point we need to keep uh, remember is a struggle for its uh, existence as there are limited number of resources as you can see some points i have written the resources are very limited so there is a uh, competition in case of survival also limited resources environment may be hostile uh, overpopulation in case of resources as there might be some overpopulation they have to fight with one another so that they can survive lastly the end result is depending on the fitness that is if they are able to stay if they are able to sustain the environment only then they can can be considered as the fittest member to survive in this atmosphere